first game. Hey, let's put all our thinning cards in. Yep. Here's Mill. Alright, so we put all our thinning cards back in the deck. We go... Here, here. Here. Yep. <laughs> First game. Morning, sir. Socks off to a rough start so far. Yeah. Scoots my boots. I uh, I hope they they do good this year. Go little. They'll do better than last year, and they hate when they lose to the fucking Yankees, dude. It drives me nuts. I have no way. I have. N Is there a way that I can kill this? Definitely don't want to banish my own cards this round. Ah, oh, shit. I think if we stay in the lead, Arendite. Yeah, see, he's getting rid of all these. That's good, right? I put fur cart back in the deck. Did we lead her this early? Having both these in hand is good. Because he can't mill the... I mean, we have what? Uh, not really. I guess we'll see, huh? Don't want to play the Siri too early either, though. He invos this. Okay. I knew I would get this. I just knew the first game that I play hyper thin, I would run up against this shit. Same thing, huh? It's like a mirror, but reverse. We invo that. That way, if he does it again, we got another one. <laughs> okay, so he goes leader. I think we're going to have to go lead. He didn't draw a snowdrop, though, which is good. So his deck's going to get a little weird, because he still has a mage assassin in there. Roderick's looking for... Vilgaforts. Oh, that's just going to be that T-Bore. That's fine. He has to mill that, right? Yeah. Yeah, he has to. Um. Do we go for this now? He never passes, right? If we could save Snowdrop and Tactical Decision, that would be pretty good. We can't ever play this, though. I guess we could.
The problem's going to be... That gets Vilga forced, right? But it's slow for him. Oh, he just got the snow drop on that one. Okay. We're getting there, though. Damn, we're one short on this. Does he have red haze? No. I gotta be careful because I do mill myself a card with this. So we just kill this, huh? Seems fair. Making this round longer isn't good, though. He has one more of those, so we... He probably drew one. So we kill it. We're okay on points, right? Play this next. He has one, too, though, right? Yeah, he never passes. Damn it. Don't mill the Triss. That's good. That's a thin... Well, I guess it buffs up this if I put it back in the deck. Sixty-one. They have ring two? Yeah. Pretty sure. Maybe they didn't draw it yet. Their Cantarella is going to get weird. Right? Next we just play the Fur Cart. That's fine. Ooh, it just like jumped out of my hand. I didn't even get to place it anywhere. Arendite's gonna be sick. I mean, it's a nine. We're gonna have to lead her, though. Yeah, we're gonna have to lead her. We don't put this on the top, right? We go here, here, here. I don't want to play this, though. Seventy points. Oh, I can't even... It, this just plays for 7, though, right? Yeah, that's... Problem is, all I have is this. And they have 8 carryover. I knew the minute I played this deck... So they have Vilgaforts and they win. On even with carryover. No. We got a shot. It's slim. It's a very... Oh, we have carryover too. We're okay. Somewhat. Definitely don't... Really? Oh, wait. That gives us Golden Necker. Shit. Everything becomes 50-50s then. Oh, no. 
Like, really? All these cards and I draw that? Oh. What a sad world. We, we did what we needed to, but we just... So far, this seems like... I mean, Mill is going to be a problem. Please fuck off. <laughs> yeah, please fuck off. I mean, we have a 12-point 12, 12 Erendite. Fuck. It's going to hit for, what, four? Five? an eight. The problem is they have Vilgaforts. And this is what card is it? What card did they invo? Snowdrop? So this played for eight for him. Seven because of the Cantarella. It's not enough points. It's not enough points. Yanur, how are you? Four. He needs 10. 13. It's not enough. No we win. <laughs> That's fucking mill. <laughs> We're not going to be able to play this deck. I can tell you right now. I can tell you right now. Anything that's thinning got to go. Um, can you click yet? Not yet, huh? That'd be OP, right? Dead Man's Tongue. Golden Necker. None of these are thinning. We have one option. We have the carryover. Why did we have to do this? Why? This is very true. So it's all God. Wait, it might be Clog. Why would it be Clog? <laughs> Why? Why would it be Clog? Oh, it's actually what we're playing. It's Hyper Thin. So Hyper Thin versus Hyper Thin. Huh. And I got rid of my thinning cards. Imagine that. So we try to correct. Redemp cheese. How are you? We're trying to play hyper thin, but it's just gonna make it real awkward. The all god inclusion is nice, I guess, for the knickers. Does he play twenty three? Really? So he does, he, wow. It's other than this, oh yeah, I forgot Sarthisius. Huh. This man knows how to build a deck. Somebody screenshot that. <laughs> looks good. I don't know about the Megascope though. Everything else looks good. Um Look at that. An actual pikeman friend. Megascope for Golden Necker. Yeah. 
The problem is, though, is you have a lot of these bigger... Like, you don't really... The, the cards you have, like, they don't really synergize with it. Except for this. That, did he have in, he has invo too right no he can't because oh yeah he can why do we have invo in our hyper thin deck really mage assassin that seems really slow now he passes we get our siri nova erendite being an absolute turd right now This, this is risky because he has... Wow. 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 Like, he had... He still has a fawn in the deck. Mage Assassins. That was just... Extremely well played there. But 52 points ain't happening. What does the this mysterious puzzle box do? I'm confused about the card. Okay, so here's what happens. You play it on your opponent's side of the board. Uh, hold on, let me mulligan real quick. Um, I mulligan both of these, right? Because he could play Tibor and I'll be real sad. Have any more tactics? No. Do we have any locks? No. That's okay. So it's like a mini game. You play it, it goes on the other side of the board, spawns a seven. And then you and your opponent, so they're in it. I have none of the, the pingy boys. I have this. So he has them all in hand already because he did it backwards. Yeah, his see his hand's going to be really awkward. I have to lead her, or have to snowdrop now, though. Invo's good. Um, one, two. I could grab up an eight. It's not bad. I think I dropped the puzzle box for right now. Man, I've been like taking a long time. Point away. Gotta go. Thanks for the stream. Alright, man. Take care. Cole Rekaput. Welcome. How are you? So he's going to have a little bit more carryover than me. We banish this. Oh, that sucks. I only have one bronze card left in the deck. I just yoinked the snowdrop, right? Oh no, I want to play Siri Nova.
I faced the Compass Golden Necker Fury deck with my half ass Siege Stockpile deck. I got it. Really? It beat you? That's surprising. Oh, no. Yennefer. Well, we could draw one of them. So we play this first, and we pick the Erendite, because it has nothing. <laughs> oh, Golden Necker only plays a unit. Still, still kind of new to this? Whoa! That got destroyed. <laughs> oh, man. Um, it's all right, man. You got any questions, you just ask, dude. I don't have any special cards in the deck. I guess I just grab up the eight. Oh, wait. We go fur cart first. Oh, wait. Now nah, that's only a three. This is a seven. Steeds is a cool deck to stick with. Yeah, it, it, it definitely has its... Uh... Oh, shit. Well. Oh, wait. Thank you. <laughs> I'm kind of confused on the game plan here. Like, so he bricked everything and he just wants to play. So he converted the mill. Forty-one to eight, Maxi. I'm confused what just happened here. The where we ran into hyper thin that turned the mill. They don't. They have a two in there, right? A four. I don't have any specials left. Triss hits for four. Eight. Oh, shit. So we just play this last, huh? Hit a four. Yay! And then we have a 13. And he hit the eight. I think he wins. Fifty-nine, twenty points. How did I get milled? Nine point Arendite. <laughs> what did you? No pirates. Okay. Pirates sounds interesting. Keep this in hand. We could put all brick on top. It's interesting. I think we get rid of this because they're going to have all kinds of armor. Ooh. Do we have a location left? Yeah, puzzle box. <clears throat> it's a boat. Special would we want to play? Invo? The 
That's so much. That's so much value for him. Like, I'm okay with it. I forgot we got these in here. See, he's wondering if I'm Mill or not. <laughs> he's like, go. Oh. Raider. So he goes... have the Cessner. I doubt they're usually devotion, right? They just use that delirium, really. That's kind of slow. And a rain friend, wow. I didn't expect that. Let's see what he plays. Because he wants to play another boat, right? Next we play this, I guess. Maybe up here. Cessner's going to get weird. But we got to get good Arendite value, especially with these. Oh, that's good. It still didn't spawn. It's only up to four, which kind of sucks. Him only playing it. Really? He's okay losing on even. Wow. So we look for some Blight Makers. Siri Nova, Golden Necker. We got some really bad pulls here. I forgot I changed this around. Croc. Damn, we're just short. A Cessner now turns it to a six and I can kill it. We grab up their raider though, right? It's a big target for him. I think the problem I'm going to have is I'm not going to have any units left. Dimmon. Uh, well, this is dead. That's good. So if he was hoping for that, next we can go Snowdrop. Leader. Leader. 
That's fine. So we go here first. Then we play tactical decision. Oof. And this got rough quick. <laughs> Um, I guess we dropped the Cessna too. Really, we drew those. Oh, they they automatically were coming back, right? Now he plays Morkvarg. Yeah, this one got all kinds of weird. We gotta make some adjustments. We're going to pull a two, aren't we? Oh, we pulled the Siri. And he gets a 13. Ouch. Well, that didn't work out in our favor, did it? He can actually kill this, can he? Really? Wow. Does he pick anything? I think we get everything out of him, though, right? Wow, I got a 13 strike thing in the box. I'll take it. Do I got any heals? I do. Worked out pretty good. The real question is do they have a GERD? It's only one point. the Cree into this thing did a lot of work we get everything out of them He has Royal Decree, so he's not Devotion. Dogor. And a Leader Charge. Nice. So he's got a Hope for Fakusha. So we're hoping for Blight Makers and maybe a... Oh, we have Arendite. For 13. Yeah, this got all kinds of wonky here. I think we just go uninteractive, to be honest. I think this is fine. He wants to do damage. Hey, against the wholesome pirate thing, how's it going? It's going good, man. I, um... I think we're going to be okay. I don't think he can kill everything of ours. So, we got to make some adjustments to this. That has no armor, so it doesn't do anything now. So, I don't think he can kill... Can he kill everything? One, two, three. We have no units. Yeah, we gotta take these out. And find a better way to thin Fakusha. 
Into Gerd. Um. We win by one point. Two points. Wow. <laughs> I'll take it. We got to make some adjustments to this, though.